Today I'm just going to be doing a silver makeup tutorial and I think silver is a really good neutral look that you can just wear pretty much every day and I have well it is really pink blush but you kind of can't tell on camera and just kind of like a darker look. Oh and if you noticed I did get my hair done it's a lot blonder now and my bangs are shorter. They actually can be worn straight across but I don't like that. Sorry it's a little twisted. But, um, I have 50 subscribers now, so I will be doing a giveaway, and I'm just giving away something simple, and it'll just be one of these Revlon cream, Re cream eyeshadow palettes, and they are my favorite, so that is why I'm doing a giveaway for that. So, if you want to be considered for the gi this giveaway, please just make one comment. I don't, uh, preferably it'd be a request for some thing for a video but it could just be any comment and then I will consider you in this giveaway so thank you all for watching and thank you all for subscribing I'm really excited that I have 50 and that's about it I hope you enjoy this tutorial thanks okay let's get started I twisted my hair back so it wouldn't be in my eyes so you can see better <clears throat> and I'm just gonna take my MAC shadow and this is in the color Idle Eyes, and it's just a real pretty silvery color. Focus, I guess. And I'm just gonna take just your average eyeshadow brush, pat it in the color, and then pat it on my eye, on the lower lid. like that. Oops. And <clears throat> sorry. Next I'm going to use my Pro Fusion palette. This is the 120 Extreme Sheer Eye Colors. And I'm just going to take this it's almost like a blackish gray. It kind of looks black, but it's it's pretty gray. It's not extreme black. And I'm just going to take a crease brush. You know it's for your crease because it's slanted. And I'm just going to swipe it in that color. Tap off any excess. And you just want to put it in your crease. So I don't want to cut myself out of the frame. Just put that in your crease. And then you want to take a blending brush and you just want to blend that out. Blend it up and blend it out. Yep. And then next you want to just take a highlight brush and I'm using that same palette. I'm just going to be using this really light, almost champagne-y looking color. And you just swirl your brush in that. And you just put that right under your brows. On the side of the wrong eye. Right under your brow. I seem to do the wrong eye a lot. Is that weird? Okay, next I'm just going to be using this Beauty Rush Liquid Glitter Eyeliner, and it is from Victoria's Secret. And I'm just going to line my eyes with it, and when I line my eyes, I start from the middle and go out. And when I go back to the very inner corner, and go out to the middle. So my hair's kind of poofy right there. I just noticed that. Okay, and then I'm going to be taking this Claire's glitter pen, which I've used in middle many of my tutorials. So maybe it was a good present. And this one's just the silver one. And I'm gonna go. Oops. Kind of got. I'm just gonna go underneath the eye. I'm going to go probably about halfway. 
and make sure you just wipe any like excess you have that's like fallen and then I'm going to go to the corner and go out so there's a little bit under your eye that's not lined Pretty. I really like silvery looks. I'm wearing kind of silver, as you can see, I'm wearing very silvery today. <laughs> and then, I'm just going to do your, your lashes. First, you want to curl your lashes. You just take an eyelash curler. And curl. Curl, curl, curl. And I'm using the Maybelline Falsies Volume Express. And this works amazing on your top lashes. But I don't like them on my bottom lashes. Because it makes it really smudgy. So for my bottom lashes, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Lash Stiletto. Because I think the brush is a lot smaller. So it makes it, let's see, the brush is a lot smaller. So it makes it a lot easier to do your bottom lashes. But I wipe it off before I do it. Just so you don't have like a bunch on your bottom lashes. <laughs> and see I have like some excess under my eyes. I had a wet cloth, but I don't know where it is. Okay, um cheeks. I'm using the Maybelline Dream Mousse Blush in tin. Pink frosting. And like I wanted to try this but I was like oh I don't know. But I just bought it anyways just to try. And like it's really weird looking. Focus. There we go. And it's like I don't know it feels weird. But you just put like a finger one of your fingers in it. Get about that much on there. Can you see? And then just smile. Find your apples. And then you just rub it. And rub it up. It's really pink. But it's super pretty. And get the same amount again. You pretty much just dab your finger in it about twice. And then I get a tiny bit tiny tiny bit and I just add that on my nose and my forehead just cause I feel if I don't my face doesn't match right like I know your cheeks are supposed to be pinker that's why I put a lot more on my cheeks but I don't I don't know I just like the look and it feels kind of like you're blushing I think it looks sweet <laughs> And then for the lips, I'm using, <clears throat> it's by Hard Candy, and it's called Mouthing Off Sheer Lip Shine, and this is in the color Sweet Treat. Looks like that. And it's a really pretty fall color, or winter color, I should say. It's dark. Can you see that? Yes, you can. It's like a darker color. I like it. And it's really soft going on. And that's it. Hope you guys like this tutorial. Please subscribe and follow me on Twitter. Thank you.